Hi everyone, I'm Sindre9, welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 3. Now that we've done all of that, we head back to Angel Tower. Again, Gar in front. Again, battle because we entered the area. <laughs> now, I don't remember if I showed this off or not, but there is another place we can go in here. That's where we'll be heading. It had a uh, blue pyramid. Dead. Thank you, Nina. And it looked like there was somebody inside. That's where we'll be heading. And I believe it's over here. Yes. One more battle. These monsters won't be a challenge because we came here quite a bit earlier, so your character should have some more levels. Down here... Guardian, come closer. You big oaf! You bone-headed guardian! What you think you are doing? Entombing, entombing me in this temple for 500 years! I've half a mind to blast you into orbit! So, guess the fact that you've released me shows that you're finally willing to listen to what I have to say? Idiot! Well, maybe not completely hopeless. What have you done? What do you think you're doing, you buff- Boon, idiot! But our god has told us they're wicked and evil. And you never thought she might be wrong, you imbecile! I'll take you to meet your fool god. Deus, show more respect for our god, or else. If each and every last member of the brood had indeed been killed, they see Ryu is red in the face, all would have been lost. But there's still one of the brood left. And what of God? First things first, Guardian! The spirits of the dead dragons are too strong here. We need to go someplace else. There should be a cave at the base of the volcano to the west of here. I'll meet you there. Volcano to the west. Got it, my little dragon? Nod, nod. Volcano to the west. She must mean Mount Sobo. Mm-hmm. Wait just a minute! Why do you have such a goofy look on your face, Ryu? <laughs> Were you not paying attention, Nina? <laughs> 
anyway, so there's that. Uh, that's Days. Now, as you can see, she was... That was her in the cutscene, you know, part snake. If you know Breath of Fire, does that remind you of anybody? It should. It should remind you of Blue. Now, because that was, you know, 500 years, and Blue's been around a long time in the other Breath of Fires, this is what kind of links the universes together. Well, it's one of the things. People say that Deus is blue from the other Breath of Fires, for Breath of Fire 1 and 2. That that's, that's her. So, that's a thing. Anyway, we're going to head to Mount Zobo. And remember that cave entrance that just had the, uh, that thing we couldn't read? Well, that's where we're going. Right in here. Also, let's not mess with the all-powerful sorceress. You know, who just beat the snot out of Gar without even casting a spell. And we know she's a much better spellcaster, so... I think this is the place Deus meant. Hmm? We... There you are, my little dragon. Don't be frightened. This is what I really look like. Again, a big resemblance to Blue. <laughs> Were you expecting me to show up naked again? In that form, the one I was imprisoned in I'm not able to fully utilize my powers, see? That's too bad! <laughs> no, no, we're gonna be a polite, nice little dragon. I like you this way. Well, thanks! You certainly know what to say to a lady, don't you? So, now that you're all here, is this where we'll meet God? No, silly. I'm gonna tell you how to get there from here. I like Deus a lot, by the way. <laughs> Before I was imprisoned, I would have been able to take you there myself. But I don't have enough strength left to do it now. Alright, my little Ryu. I'm going to open your eye, so you'll be able to see the way yourself. Mm -hmm. It might hurt a little, but you'll just have to grin and bear it. My... Ryu? Mm -hmm. Ryu is called Prana, the Eye of God. If you follow that light, you'll find the God who used the Guardians to destroy your people. North? Far, far away to the north, across the sea. How you get there is up to you. I can't do it for you. This is all I can do now. No, join the party! It's up to you now, Ryu. Good luck! Bye! Gar, I want you to look out for him. Make sure nothing happens to him. Understand? 
I swear by the lives of all the brood I stole. He will not come to harm while I draw breath. Whew. I must be getting old if something like this knocks the wind out of me. <laughs> you must be feeling your age as well, sister. Ryu, Gar! First Ryu, then you, Gar, just disappeared like that! I was so frightened! What happened? Did you see Deus? Did you meet God? Yes, no. God is very far away, across the sea. Hmm. Looks like we'll be needing a boat. Hmm, I wonder where we can get a boat. Well, it didn't go so great the first time, ten years ago, or however long it's supposed to be. But we'll try that again. By the way, you could use this to travel where Deus resides. But she must be tired now and needs to rest. However, we can come back here later. After she's recovered some. And Deus can actually become a master. We'll get to that when it's when we can actually do that. Alright, that's everything here. So, how about we try to get a boat? Because <laughs> it went so great the first time. Uh, real quick, since we got since we got some time. Any changes? Two more fairies. Uh, increase the village size. I've set somebody to uh, cultivate, which is to clear out some land. And culture level has rose. So as you can see, it's a little bit of a town now. There's a little area here now. Woo! Help us, help us. Tell us what we should be doing to build our village. Yes, I already know what to do. Now the... So, we're clearing spots. Let's see what you're good at. Um, you have a lot of hunt, so we'll go ahead and let you do that. I also put three people here to do culture. That way we get culture to seven as quickly as possible. So we start getting culture up. And uh, set them to start learning jobs. Um, I suppose for right now, you just clear as well. Two, three, four, five, and six. That'll do for now. The fairy village starts off really slow, but don't worry. It's well worth it in the end. You'll see. However, time to get a boat. Not the lighthouse. Let's go to the wharf. Lighthouse. The yeah, answer's used to cut their way through the channels. But it's not much use if the ships broke down. Great. Better not have sunk with all my merchandise on it. Guildmaster's taking care of that right now. What's going on? It'd be good if Shays' kids turned out big and strong. Like me. But they'll probably take after Braid. So, Shadis and... Look, they have a little one now. <laughs> hey, Shadis, what's going on? This way. This way. Huh? It's Ryu, isn't it? Uh-huh. <laughs> How are you? We haven't seen you for a long time. It's a long story. <laughs> Babe? He went to Junktown to get back our ship. Hmm? I'm sure he'll be coming back soon. So, if you don't mind waiting... Oh, 
Fell down. Aww. Uh, there you go. I'm sorry. I don't have much to do with guild business anymore. You'll have to wait until he comes back. Now she's full-time mom. <laughs> Alright, well, instead of waiting for him to come back, we should head to Junk Town ourselves and see what's going on. So that's exactly what we're going to do. This way and out. We can take a look at the stores, but I'm pretty sure they didn't change. Pretty sure. <laughs> Only the best weapons. Uh, changed a little bit, I think. I don't remember. Well, maybe it did have spike claws before. Uh, anyway, here's some gear, but you more than likely have better. When we get to Junk Town, that might be a different story. You might be buying some stuff there. Because if you remember, they had some really good stuff. But it was all really expensive. You probably have a little bit of cash now, so... I would have more cash if I didn't pay the 10k to, uh, what's his name? <laughs> now if I just remember where Junk Town is, back across the mountain. I wish once you've gone through this place once, like a lot of other things, you could just walk through it. And you could choose to enter if you want to, to try to talk to Deus. But that's unfortunately not the way it is, so. I mean, it's not that far of a walk as you see. It's just, I don't know, it could have been a very nice little convenience thing. Anyway, Junk Town is over here, where the ship is. Welcome to Home of the Machine Guild, Junk Town! Not exactly a name to be proud of, is it? <laughs> Got more for sale than just junk! Titan Belt, which gives you 10 power. High Boots, which gives you 5 defense. Wisdom Ring, which raises intelligence. Lion Belt, which raises willpower. That willpower stat. You know, your chance to have the guts action go off and not fall down. Dynamite Weather Vane Taser Belladonna has a chance to just insta-kill a target. Firecracker, which is a bigger dynamite. No. It's a bigger, I can't remember. And Icicle. There you go. All these uh, hit all targets except the Belladonna. That's what's in the item shop. In the weapon shop. Flame Chrism, Ice Chrism, the Shotgun Shell, which if you remember, we bought that. Barbarossa, which has the electric property and gives way more attack power to Ryu. Thunder Rod, which gives a huge boost of attack power to Nina, property electric. And Gigantress, which would be a very nice upgrade for Gar if you didn't get the Beast Spear, which we have. <laughs> Um, hmm. I mean, it doesn't raise int, it just raises her attack power when she swings with her staff. I'm gonna buy the Barbarossa for... for Ryu. Yeah. We'll do that. And now I'm broke! <laughs> so that's the thing. Oh, uh, let's... Instead of just leaving town, I didn't come here just to buy stuff. 
My name is Babe, Rafella Guildmaster. I've come to get our boat back. Uh... What? Uh, yes, of course. Good to see you again. Dock is to the west. Go on in. That's right! Bait is now the Guildmaster! Alright, now we have access to this part, which we've never had before. Uh, there's Steel Beach over here. There's a fishing spot here, but we're gonna keep walking to this cabin. Hi! I'm working on some new fishing gear, but I can't seem to get it quite right. See that? Rehears the voice of the brood, and you get the, I don't know, Gene. <laughs> no, it's not that it's, you know, you have to figure out what it is later or anything like that. No, it's the question mark, question mark, question mark, Gene. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> when spliced, question mark? So... There's that. Now, I made notes on this one. Where did I put them? Guess I can go ahead and move back while I'm while I glance around for those. And our next stop will be this dock right here. Going to enter it. This is the Machine Guild's dock. This is where we send the machines out on ships. How do they get big machines like this on the ship? I don't know. I'm just a repairman. <laughs> Let's see. Ship parts. Ship parts. I guess you're going to have to go down to Steel Beach for those. Should I already talk to you? Was that the Rafala Guildmaster who was here just now? If we'd known such a big shot was coming... We would have worked faster. <laughs> I mean, he is the guildmaster now, so he is a big shot. I remember you were looking for parts to fix the ship. Did you find any? Well, let's see what's going on. You mean the repairs aren't finished yet? Well, you see, sir, we didn't know you'd be coming so soon, you see? We haven't found the parts we'd be needing yet, you see? Hmm. I see. What should I do now? I told everyone I'd be back soon. S sorry, sir. We didn't know it'd be taking so long to find the parts, you see. Excuse me, sir. Guildmaster, sir. But you don't be planning on having us be looking for parts now, do you? I mean, we're sailors, right? Huh? Wait a minute. You're Ryu, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Long time no see, Bade. 
it's so good to see all of you again. I'll never forget what you did for me all those years ago. But what are you doing here? We need a boat. <laughs> huh? You need a ship? Well, I'd like to say I can help you with that, but... Uh... Looks like the repairs are gonna take longer than we thought. You're gonna have to wait again. Just like before. I'm sorry. Hmm. Well, we can't really wait. Sorry, but I don't know a thing about repairs. You'll have to ask someone who knows more about machines. Which we already heard. Aren't you the ones who helped us fix the lighthouse before? That is correct. Now that you mention it, you've been to Rafala before, right? Yup. <laughs> So, we already know our next destination. We heard it from one of the guys. We're going to be heading to Steel Beach. Now, there are a few things that we could do with the, I don't know, Gene. <laughs> so, let me show those off as a fun way to end this episode. Before we head to uh, Steel Beach. Let's see, where is... Yeah, mystery effect. I don't know, even has a question mark on it. <laughs> uh, miracle, there it is. If you combine miracle with the, I don't know, effect. And I think you can add other stuff, like I could add a defender or something like that. And you'll also be able to see Guard take damage from his Beast Spear. Mammoth! No, you won't, because this takes it. Now, does that look familiar? However, it is not the same one you've seen before. Because normally, it doesn't make a uh, Mammoth. What is the name of what it what it normally makes? It makes... Uh, Man, I blanked out. <laughs> behemoth, right? Yes. It, it normally makes behemoth. However, this is mammoth. Look at the HP. You are reading that correctly. 1,330 HP. This thing gets like 100 or 1,000% HP or something like that. It's ridiculous. However, it has lower defense. Now, the fun thing you can do, you have Giant Growth here, attack multiple targets, you have Meteor Strike, which remember, it takes about half of your HP as damage. <laughs> Ow, see, 42. Because the Mammoth has such a low defense value. However, while you have that lots of HP, you can do lots of damage it's a fun form to take so there so there's that to do the other thing I actually need Momo in the party Wrong menu. I believe I need Momo and Gar. So we'll just get into another fight. Now, remember when we did the Ascension with... We fused... Fused... With Momo and Gar. Let me just do that. Uh, 
as they throw up shield. No, I think I need Nina, don't I? Yep, well. Darn it. <laughs> I was thinking of fusing Nina with with Gar. Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> Even I make mistakes, so if the fusion fails, guess I can show this off. When fusion fails, you just get this. You get a standard whelp. No elements or anything, it's just a standard whelpling. Dead. Let me try that again. <laughs> Sorry, sometimes I get the I get the uh, fusions uh, mixed up between the characters. One more time. Well, two more times technically. And Momo, and that should make what I want. Let's try this again. Now, if we use fusion, oh, you stop the defense action. That's annoying. <laughs> Hybrid. You make this mechanized. Uh, armor dragon thing, remember? You know, it was fun to use. Because we could use combustion and it's really funny. Which I got knocked out of it. Thanks, enemy. Hate air raid for that reason. <laughs> Reprisal! What you die? Fine. You remember combustion, right? Oh, that still didn't do as much as I needed it to. Go away! Okay, so there's that. However, let me get the AP back real quick. we can now make a better form. Every hybrid form has a an upgraded form to it, if you have the right genes. Which we do now. For Momo's hybrid form, you need the, oh, uh, gene. <laughs> I'll just call it the question mark gene from now on. So, if we take fusion and the question mark gene and use that instead, hybrid. You get this. Now, notice the color. It's more of a goldish color kind of keeping up the theme with you know if it's a better form it's gold like we had the gold whelpling form the gold dragon form now with that comes a few extra abilities also the uh, stat boost is higher that you get from changing into the form 
Comet. Remember Ragnarok? Ryu can actually cast it in this form. You still have Combustion, which is really fun. I think Ragnarok's the only change here, other than getting a bigger uh, boost. Sure, why not? Because it's fun. <laughs> Ragnarok! Oh, it hit! <laughs> uh, you'll still get more out of combustion. For now, since that's actually a spell, if Ryu's int is high enough, I believe you can get Ragnarok to do even more damage when it hits. But, there you go. That's all I have for you this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you had a lot of fun. I wanted to show off those those uh, additional forms since we have the since we can do that now. And next time we're going to head to Steel Beach to find ship parts. That way we can get a ship. <laughs> And I think Steel Beach is a semi lethal dungeon. I honestly can't remember. But regardless, we'll be searching there next time. Until then, I'm Sandre9. Remember to shoot for the stars and take care, everyone.